Well, it's a, it's a great feeling. It's a great feeling and I'm happy for the people of Zimbabwe and I hope I'm going to represent them well. This is the beginning of uh, the new chapter of politics of Zimbabwe, where we are going to focus on the issues, uh, national issue, issues of national interest, not party politics. Hello viewers, welcome back to Ramsay TV. Pana pata na kupenye tika tena siya na maapu tisi shuru transpo kwa matumene inyi kane sinji mwaza katiko mbeleta. Mandu pangu wa zine sinitine mfito na kupata na pana pana singi tusha bangu. Reba shoku ata ora kachi kama zi wana waka wanda. Um, pa anga achango peza kuitwa soni inu mpali ya mendevavi kutubuda kumont hampton ukukata uwanda kuti ata ura mashoku akichikisa wanu waka wanda na kuna kukuti ito kwa kati seti nosa kuti munu ano gara achita ura demokrasi pa munu mpake pati vajinji maru kufungi zita kuti ane inge asiru kuziwa zinorewa the word demokrasi na kuna kukuti dae aziziwa chanishinu zi demokrasi ayu waka aisa ita hand over two thirds majority batu za npf ashinyatu obvisa wanu wano zila kuti Waka saru zwa ni wanu Masa 23 aga sijiripa mtimu Panguwa ya zanga shaka uuma Ayu waka pati tripu siya kakwa nisa kumanager Two thirds majority mba tripu mpali ya mindi, pati mzwara nasta wana kuti ayu waka, ranga rete zwa guru lake, hapo pati mwona ashi mininika, ashi taura mashuka gumbura miru jinji, aita kuti vani waka wanda vasha misike kuti ayu waka senge sosha bangu, wae ashi ita zwa anu itezi, kuna zime nye kasa ya mashia bangu, aide atu wa mchukuru maximum prison, aide awe kutota wala kuti kwa jinezi, awe kujidemba, pati unfortunately ee, zune zwa chosu waka siyana hapo pati wana ee, and seven others, machitu wa suwono ini msora nasi, but ndo dati uzi nziro mega pa mashuko hata ura afundu sa wanu waka wanda, mwazo nza cha mdofu wa mkume sikri na sikana chungu lufi sinimi ya wadipi hii, feel free to subscribe on this channel for more information for more updates till next time, it's bye for now after your swelling in today well, it's a great feeling it's a great feeling and I'm happy for the people of Zimbabwe and I hope I'm going to represent them well this is the beginning of uh, the new chapter of politics of Zimbabwe, where we are going to focus on the issues, uh, national issue, issues of national interest, not party politics. All right, and uh, for some, um, does it signify that uh, the party is still alive? Very much alive. The reason that I'm still standing, the reason that my colleagues, I and my colleagues are still standing up, we're being sworn in today. It's alive to that the party is alive. It's also alive that uh, the movement is alive. It's also alive that we are in control. Uh, we are in charge of this movement and we are going to continue at, uh, discharging our duties. What's your message to your colleagues from the city of City? Well, time is ticking away from them. We, they need to embrace uh, the moving train. Uh, we are the people, we are the people who are we are an alternative, we need to benchmark, we need to put uh, the government on its toes, we need to put ZANU-PF uh, in terms of policy direction in the right framework of, uh, uh, of discussion. So we are not going to pinpoint each other as ZANU or as triple C, but we are going to define in terms of principle, in terms of ideology, in terms of policy framework, uh, but we remain Zimbabweans. What national issues do you think we are bringing to Look, the, 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 we, 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 we are facing drought. Uh, we need to make sure that no one starts, no one dies because of hunger. Uh, we are going to make sure hold this government accountable. You look at the state of our roads, you look at the state of our schools, you look at the state of our hospitals, they are deplorable. So we are there as, as the government uh, and as the alternative to make sure that this issue.